Hey, yo, hey, yo, yo, nigga, do you know what the fuck you doing? Oh, yo, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm chilling, I'm chilling, chilling. Nah, nigga, you ain't chilling, nigga, you stalking. What the fuck is you doing, nigga? Since when did that become cool? Alright, I don't know what's wrong with my phone. I had to. This bot guy just showed up. I just got here to the park. This blue car right here was already here. But they stalk us anyway. Because they always show up anywhere when I when I do get here. I just got off from work. Um I was gonna go to the gym, but I decided to just come to the park. I just wanted to come outside for a little bit. You know what I mean? So we got Um and this person right here just showed up. And they over there. So they want you know, like I said, man, you know. The gang stalking don't stop. Oh, then now y'all leaving? <laughs> they 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 know. They know when you're recording. They know. You know what I mean? Check him out. Y'all y'all leaving? Y'all leaving too? That that shit is nice though, ain't it? Ain't that fucking uh caddy nice though? I think that's a caddy, right? The white walls. Same 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 color as my car. That thing nice. I like it. I like that John. I should go ahead and say, break yourself, gang stalker. Break your fucking self like men of society. You know what I'm saying? Break yourself. Break yourself. Like they did uh, Kane Cousin. You know what I mean? Run up on him. Get your body ass up off this nice ass car. You know what I mean? But that's all I wanted to show y'all, man. Look, check, check out the chemtrails in the sky. You know what I mean? Then you wonder why, um, you know, like I said before, man. We, we You know, the chosen. And look at these gnats, man. Damn, y'all congregating near me. Um, yeah, y'all see it. I tell you, man, for the ones that's woke in this simulation, consider yourself blessed and cursed at the same damn time. You know, you're blessed because you woke up and you know who you are. You know what I mean? You realize that you got the power. At least that's what you're supposed to. You know what I mean? If you if you caught up in religion, then you you, you know you on the wrong channel. You know what I mean? Cause this ain't no this ain't no gospel channel over here. I gotta keep reminding certain people that they always want to come on my channel. I know they bots. You know what I'm saying? Either they just bots or they just ignorant ass bastards. But they want to keep coming on my channel talking about some yeah. Just give your little, give your life back to Jesus and all this stupid nut ass shit, motherfucker. I am Jesus. I am the Christ, nigga. Why you think they fucking with me? Just like they, that's like they was fucking with Jesus Christ. You know what I'm saying? Yahushua, Yahusha, whatever name you want to call him. You know what I mean? Y'all think Christ was Jesus' last name. Christ means anointed, the Messiah. Christos is a Greek word, you fucking idiots. Go ahead and do your homework. Stop running your mouth and fucking study. That's what y'all need to do. You know what I mean? You got too many people out here just running your fucking mouth. And once again, too, I want to say real quick. Uh, to these astrologers now, you know, already know I'm down with astrology and everything But everybody always giving their energy to the moon and shit You know say oh man the solar moon and the moon and mercury and retrograde and and we, we got a wan and moon and a waxing moon and all this all this shit But don't you know that researchers say David Icke said it and many others said it that the moon ain't nothing but a fucking satellite And even when you watch the movie Truman Show When you watch the movie Truman Show where 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 was the Demiurge guy? Where was he at? He was inside the fucking moon. That's where he was at. Watching Truman. Watching Mr. Truman. That's where he was at. That's where you're your bot guy right here. That's what that's what that's what y'all is. Y'all, a lot of y'all motherfuckers is that guy. Walking around here senseless. Trying to trying to make trying to make a dollar out of 15 cent gang stalking somebody. When you can go ahead and work at McDonald's or something. I'd rather work at McDonald's than to be a gang stalker. You know what I mean? I'll flip a burger. Before I fucking ride around stalking somebody. But anyway, back to this moon. Everybody's always talking about, you know, the moon. I've been wanting to speak on this for a long time. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, you already know that I'm into everything. Astrology, numerology, you name it. I'm a researcher. But what I'm saying is, people always say, man, the moon, when it's a full moon, there's a lot of uh, bloodshed and stuff like that. And there's a lot of energy with the moon. But how do, how do you know that we're not the ones that's responsible for that shit? Because you got to understand, we are the creators, right? The co-creators, right? You know what I mean? 
You think they be sending all these agents around you if you ain't had no type of fucking power? Get the hell out of here. You got to be out your damn rabbit ass mind. So, so my point is, what I'm saying is about the moon, people always be talking about the energy. The energy, the energy is in the moon. No, the energy is in you. The energy is in you. We doing all these rituals and shit. We, we, we lighting candles. We, 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 uh, we got all this apothecary stuff. And we talking about the moon, the moon, the moon. It's energy, it's energy, it's, it's energy. You know what I'm saying? I got, trust me, I got wicker books and stuff. I read that shit. But how do you know that the energy ain't coming from you? You know what I'm saying? Because everything at the end of the day, everything falls back on the law of attraction. They say that we're the gods of the, the world. Jesus said you are God, right? Then Jesus said you shall be able to say to a, a fucking mountain, go ahead and jump and be cast into the sea. So what the hell did that mean? That means you got power if you could do some shit like that. And that's why they spraying chemtrails. That's why they spend billions of dollars. They won't even give you no damn money so you can get a crib. You got bums out here just laying on the streets. They, they can't even have a nice ass shelter home for these for these for these bums out here. But they spend millions and billions of dollars to spray some shit in the air. One lady had told me one time. One lady, I, this was in the beginning of the jabby jab season. I told this lady, lady she was out. She was gang stalking me, so I decided to spark a conversation with her. And I said, "You see this stuff all in the sky." I said, he's spraying it. She's like, yeah. She's like, she said, why, why are they spraying it? Is, is it for the jabby jab? I said, no. It's for you to remain a damn stalker. <laughs> That's why they're spraying it. So you don't wake the hell up. They want you sleep. Somebody out here, there, there's an entity out here that's spending billions of dollars to keep you sleep. Everybody talking about the metaverse and everything. Yeah, you're going to be trapped in it. You're going to be trapped in this fucking metaverse simulation matrix. Praying, praying, and praising to the moon. The moon ain't nothing but a satellite. That's the reason why they say when you die, don't go to the light. Don't go to the light. That moon. They said they said the moon. I read, I read some, I forgot what the fuck I, I read. But they said, they said the moon is the place where, where they harvest the souls. So when you, when you exit your body upon death, if people go to the light and say they saw a bright light or whatever, it could be the moon. Hypothetically speaking, it could be the fucking moon. You going into the moon, they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna grip you up. They're gonna snatch your memory. They're gonna take your soul, throw it right back into another body. You're gonna come back out like Boss Baby, the cartoon animation, and you're gonna be back down this bitch all over again. Not knowing who you were in your past life. Not remembering that your name was James, John, Michael, or whatever. And you're going to come back down this bitch. And you got to get gang stalked all over you. Better Look, if you if you being gang stalked in this life. And you died. And you ain't finished the mission. You're going to come back there. You think they ain't going to gang stalk you again? They're going to always keep an eye on you. Because they're afraid of you. They, they know you're going to. One day you're going to uh, uh, eventually wake up. So they got to keep an eye on you. How do they keep an eye on you, D? How do they keep an eye on you? That's how they do it. Sending these assholes right here in red vehicles and also blue or greenish looking vehicles, whatever color that is. And then they got the land bots and everybody else and dog stalkers and everything. Keep on thinking that they just spending these, spending these bots all around you to implant you. To keep you on the damn radar. To try to secretly assassinate you. Just like the dude Tony said, y'all, you know, what I'm saying y'all keep on, y'all keep on thinking that um, these bots are just around, just so, just so, um, so they could agitate you. Nah, that that is beyond that, dog. They trying to kill you. They trying to kill you. I don't know everybody's targeting. Everybody targeting is different. I'm speaking from my own experience. I know every day they're secretly trying to assassinate the god. Every fucking day, they mad as shit. Every day that I'm still here, they say, "Damn, this nigga's still here. We can't stop him." I ain't leaving until my time is up. When I when I leave, when I leave this matrix, that's it. I'm out this bitch. My time is up. I got parole. I maxed the fuck out. I maxed this fucking sentence out. This is this is uh this is, we always we always given a life sentence on planet Earth, on prison planet Earth. And when I leave this bitch is a wrap. I maxed out. I'm not getting parole cuz you know when you get parole from prison, you got to walk on some time. You fuck up. They send you right back to the simulation. Nah, I'm maxing out. I'm maxing out. I don't owe you shit. 
Demi Urge, I'm out. You know what I'm saying? I'm rolling. Ain't no looking back. Ain't no going back to this matrix. Ain't nothing down here for me. You got all these beautiful women out here, you can't touch them. You got all this fucking sugar-based foods out here, you can't eat it. You can't breathe good fresh air because you got chemtrails in it. The water's all jacked up. Then they, then they sell you water in the damn plastic bottle. Now your body is all filled up with plastic. And you mean to tell me this ain't hell? Then what the fuck is it? It damn sure ain't no heaven. Every time, everywhere you turn around, everywhere you look, it's something fucked up. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's something fucked up. You're going to get the raw truth over here, player. You know what I mean? All right. Check my man out. He leaving now. Check him out. <laughs> Clown ass nigga. Check him out. Now he rolling. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, y'all. The, the red car and the, the green car still here. Ain't no, ain't no need to be in here no more. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no need to be in here. Check him out. I said, what's going on, bruh? Damn, where he at? I said, what's going on, bruh? I said, you come to work out? He said, no, 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 I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling. He gonna come over here and sit right down next to me. And lean out. Hey, man. Would you step for fun of me?